Finance. Friends, I'm also to tell you who is our Prime Minister to the Zulu Nation and the boss of the Chinese clan. If you want to talk about it, don't you want to talk about it? Friends, to learn Zulu from the Royal Family and our Royal Family members present here today. I'm a course of the Akon and I'm a course of the Akon. Mayor of King's Trial, Councillor A.T. Dooley, and other mayors present with us today. The pastors and reverends who gave us the word of God, and other men of God present here today. Amaboto, that's who I call and I to you, ladies and gentlemen, and save my humble greetings this morning. I am very happy to welcome all the dignitaries here in our city. As we all know that it is in this city where our great king, the Dragon Man, traveled when he had been defeated, I mean when he had been arrested by the British. We have committed to do development in the Escalade Beach, which will start in the construction of the road to the beach. Because it, as it is now, it does not resemble the greatness and importance of our king, of our late king. I could not even drive to the beach in December when I was performing oversight to the local beaches around the city. It is in this city where the late king, which we are celebrating today, the Prince of Papinanga and the Yamakosi, where they work very hard to establish the richest way industries and the creation of the economy of this area, which is assisting this province, the country, and the world. As a new leadership, we will make sure that we protect that what the king worked for and protect the economy of the city of our people. This city must be a safe city to live in and to invest in it. We have started budget processes to address this issue of insecurity in our, in our city. I would like to thank Mr. Ishwa and the Sivanana World for Peace Foundation for choosing the city of Mutatuza to remember our late king. Our late king loved all these people, black, colored, white, and Indians. This memorial service today is a proof of what I'm saying. The late king believed in peace and unity, and we shall strive for peace and unity as the leadership in the city. Mr. Ishwa, who is the president of the foundation, has already met with me and shared the frustrations he had been facing over the past years regarding the installation of the late king's statue. I must say that I got very disappointed by our, our good leadership of the municipality because the statue of the king was going to be done at no cost from the from statue of the municipality. But from 2014, this has not happened. Council already has passed the proposal by the foundation, and ours now to do is to identify the land and allow the foundation to go on. I have already conveyed a meeting with the foundation and the officials, which will sit tomorrow at 14 day to take this matter forward. We thank you, Chairman, Nathan Kulena Lazi, for having been delighted in the Royal Family and also in the, in, the light, the light in the whole nation. As the people of Musa Chosen, we thank you for having shown us the light and make sure that you destroy all the attempts that we get at the clouds to prevent the light and the light to the nation. We shall always support the king, our king, King Nisuzu, that's your team, we shall save this and protect about the seal. Allow us I wish to welcome you in this memorial service of our late king. Thank you very much.